we're uh, getting packed, getting ready to head out the door, and we've got about a, what, an hour drive, I think, down? Yeah, 50 minutes. 50 minutes down from the hotel, down to the field. So we're gonna get on the road and go have a very long and fun day of airsoft at the Rock. And we're here. Uh, here at the field, rock. It's way out in the country, so it's gonna have a ton of woods. Give you guys a feeling, just uh, here's some parking area of what we're gonna be into for the day. I'm excited, we pulled in, there's like G&G &G banners everywhere, like signs up. Charlie's all ready to go right here. Staying high, yes, always stay hydrated. Staying hydrated is the most important thing. So we're gonna get unpacked, I'm gonna grab some stuff out, we're gonna uh, get my gun ready, get all the batteries charged up, which hopefully they are, and uh, we're gonna get going for the day here and get to see everybody here at the field. You can never, ever have enough batteries. All the batteries. <laughs> we haven't quite started yet. They're getting ready for the briefing. We're here. Everybody's gone through chrono. Everybody's checked in. And now, the gentleman right there is getting ready to like lay the law down with all of the safety rules. Once that's done, it's about quarter after 10 right now. It's time to hit the field. And let me tell you what, this field is super cool. I had a chance to fly over with the drone, check it out before I got out to play. Now, don't let the clothes fool you. I'm changing here in a moment. I'm gonna be out there on the field doing a little pew pew time myself. But let me say, this place is so neat. It's a quarry, it's got like water and it's got like cool buildings. This place is neat and I can't wait to get out and get some gun time on it. done sun's out it's coming down getting low game's over raffles over yeah and now we're in the car charlie's driving and we're heading to smith's restaurant get some good home cooking started with barbecue now we're ending with good home cooking exactly so Wait that's up. it man that that's you can't get better with like the midwest hospitality fried tenderloin sandwich <laughs> he's got it I don't even know how to start this. He's That's... got it. He's got it. And a salad to make us all feel bad. <laughs> That's how it works. Salad to make us all feel bad. So yeah, um, the billboard said it was good. And this place is huge. So when I was in Aruba, my dealer <laughs> called me Pac-Man. Now you kind of know why, because I eat everything up. Because everything's so good. <laughs> True story. He's like, he's like, do you, like, uh, do you have a, do you have a call sign in there? I'm like, I'm gonna call you Pac. I'm like, why? It's like, cause I get the competition. He's like, no, cause you eat everything. I'm like, cause the food in Aruba was actually really good. And now for the banana pie. I know. That's some good stuff. Oh, I'm gonna hate myself later. <laughs> what are you doing tonight? See anybody? All right, so here we are at the last hotel. It's the last night, two plus hour drive, had a great dinner, we're all done with everything. I'm so full of goodness knows that that pork, oh, that pork sandwich is so good. But Charlie and I are gonna get our bags. How long we got, like 
Four hours talking to me? Four about? hours. So Four hours. I have to drop him off. Yeah. He's got to drive me to the airport. It's right around the corner. And then I'm on two different planes on to Denver and then back home. Fun whirlwind trip. Yeah, yeah. So. A really quick trip, but fun nonetheless, for yeah. sure. And you, you can tell my allergies are acting up. Fine, See, so. you didn't plan ahead. I, I took did. the pills, man. You didn't take yeah, the pills. So I can't wait to go back home. So all this goes away. My voice comes back to normal. So. But uh, it was a good trip though. It was great seeing everybody and uh, meeting everybody there. So it's well worth it. Yep. Yeah. So now it's time for bed. We're gonna see you guys in the morning. Man, tired. Three and a half, maybe four. Oh, hit the. <laughs> yeah, we're that tired. Really? We forgot. To forgot to press the button. Is <laughs> it like, like most radar mod, I guess. Yeah, like three and a half, four hours late. Three and a half hours of sleep later. We're busted into the airport. It's an hour till I board. It's only five minutes to get over there, but it's 4.30 in the morning. So uh, we should be able to get this thing done. That's it. Out of Kansas City in Denver. I've got 15 minutes here before I have to hop on the next one and then back home to Portland, Oregon. I'm gonna say this right now. I had a fantastic time in Bolivar, Missouri. Got to see everybody in the Rock Airsoft. If you guys are ever in that area and you have a chance to go play there, it's a rock quarry. It is so cool. There's water, there's all the rocks. I mean, you saw it. Definitely worth the play. Plus, the owners, everybody there, great, great community. So uh, until next time here on the vlog, I will see you guys. And also, if there's someplace you want me to go, if there's a field in your area, someplace you want me to come hang out and, and go visit and get to experience what you guys get to experience at your home field, please let me know in the comment section below. I want to know all about it. But guys, until then, I will see you at the next trip. See you later.